you know something i want to have a discussion about multiple streams of income how to get multiple streams of income in 2022 you know please please don't tell me about passive income i hate that expression <laughs> i've never heard any business worth any businessman with a salt talking about uh passive income right it's, it's a really really weird expression so uh i don't know if you've watched the mcdonald's movie you know i love that movie it opened my mind so much i like it when like this guy is trying to open franchises in multiple places and he's running out of money overhead costs are insane and the bank is giving him problem after problem after problem and somebody told him like dude you're missing the big picture this is a real estate play every time you open a franchise somewhere the franchisee has to be paying you money uh, the location has to be yours right fine the burgers will sell the soda will sell uh, the chips or fries whichever uh, you prefer will sell but you're missing the bigger play the bigger play is real estate so i love that that's like if you're a mechanic or something and somebody says just live stream it right make more money just live streaming it and other people who are doing it themselves do d d i y do it yourself i always confuse d drunking under the influence d u i <laughs> driving under the influence d i y crowd can follow you and they can learn how to do this for themselves it's like okay i really don't need to do anything uh, extra i just need to set up a camera to film me and maybe talk people through these things i'm still doing exactly what i want to be doing i'm still doing my job but i'm making more money doing something else you know and it doesn't take any great effort that's why i kind of like airbnb that's why i kind of like uber it's like i was on my way to work on the way i picked up three four people you know i already have this house okay i'm not really using these other two bedrooms like okay you know that whole thing i i love it that's why i can always tell you that I, i'm not envious of people i'm not jealous of people i'm always looking to improve on what i have and if somebody can show me a way that oh you haven't been looking at this properly if only you could do this that oh okay i was still doing that but just a little tweaking here and there wow all right so if you're a musician and you do a concert right you rent out a location and you charge people to come right you make money that way but well, wait a minute you can make money off of uh, having to sell merchandise hmm? all right you can have sponsors come sponsor your event hmm? all right people who sell food uh, food stalls can come rent your location for a certain amount of money and you give them the right to dispense food all over the place you know you record everything sell it to netflix you know that's what i'm interested in i'm i'm just a musician but i own everything around it right so what do i have uh I don't have any business going around looking at other people being envious of what they have. I own my stuff, right? Everything that's there is mine. So that's all that I've been looking for in my life, how to bring things together. Oh, okay, how can I bring this so that it works for me to be able to do what I want to do? So if there's anything that the whole lockdown period, all this thing has taught me is that you have to be digital man the power of digital distribution being online you know 
nobody can stop you even under lockdowns even under you can still be everywhere but when people don't move around when people don't they can't come to your shows they can't you have to have some form of online presence for your business so i'd like to know what else uh what you guys are doing out there and what are what are your multiple streams of income if you're comfortable sharing those things what you've been looking into what you've been researching and things like that i really have to look at this whole nft thing you know this whole metaverse thing i i i want to just study for a while just to understand where this whole thing is tilting towards the time of the guy who could just uh, wake up go to work you know do one job for 50 years or something like that it's coming to an end man or if anything there are so many risks around that so much risk that if something were to happen you still have to be able to feed yourself with your kids with your family you know so i don't know i don't know what you guys think i want to have that conversation like you have to have a life you have to have gainful employment you have to be able to afford to go here and there you know i'm not talking about huge luxuries well if you're that kind of person then good for you i'm just saying you have to be able to pay for your life you know and i'm big on production i'm, I'm really huge on pro you have to be a manufacturer of sorts you have to produce something make something it's it's funny whenever something comes from your head and later on it's something that's tangible to have a business idea oh i want to do this and then later on have it one there's nothing like it it's a creation of your own like it's like having a baby <laughs> i know a lot of girls will, <laughs> uh, will oppose that idea but it, to me it's kind of like that it's 